what it is, what it do. Boss here. <clears throat> Just came from getting some of that good old fashioned down home, hearty, back breaking, sweat hearty, complete 100% wake. Wake! Had to get that wake in, boy. Had to get that wake in. No, you don't know what I'm talking about. And no, you ain't got an idea what I'm talking about. Because it's a whole different specimen of what I'm talking about in the actions of white, wake. How to get that white in. W-O-O-I-K. That's that white. Where Eric Jones at? He knows exactly what I'm talking about. Anybody over the age of 49, 50 know what I'm talking about. Or at least have, has heard it. Work. That's work, son. Not work. Work is an entirely different specimen. Let me break it down to you. If you wish and you won't, you ain't going to get very far without the work. You got to put the work in, son. You got to put the work in. It could be your weight. It could be your job. Relationship. Selling dope, whatever you got to put the work in. You're gonna come home with empty pockets if you don't put the work in, no matter what it is you want, no matter what it is you wish for. The physical element of putting forth any and everything you got to capitalize on that goal and making it more attainable. Or you got to put that work in. Sir. You do. You can wish it, you can want it, but without the work, it's, it's pointless. You just daydreaming. You just daydreaming. You catching butterflies in the dark, sir. You know what I'm saying? Let me talk to you for a second. The word white derived from way, way, way back when. Okay. You might know or remember or have heard stories of a real old, old black woman, a real old, old black man that worked way, 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 way into their late, late stages of life. You know, they went right through their spring and summer years, worked right on up to their winter years, kept working. Ain't had no problem with it. Had more jobs than you lost. <laughs> Them retired more times you got fired. You know what I'm saying? They got multiple retirements and all that, but they still out and about trying to make something happen <laughs> before they leave. You know what I mean? They stay busy. You know, they got that desire to stay active and stay moving and stay motivated because they, they scared if they slow down or stop, then they just going to pass away. You know what I'm saying? What? They accustomed to what? They were using to what? And what what was, like, the supervisor, the foreman, the boss, the share crop master, the overseer, or the slave owner, all the way back then, would give them responsibility because they worked. They worked so much and worked so hard and worked so long, they damn near was in competition with everybody else. And you didn't get it. You know, it was like, we didn't apply for this job. This is what they're making us do. But this, the people that I'm talking about that do what, was doing it because it gave them some, some prestige. You know, boss come around and pat them on the head or the, you know what I'm saying, they'll crack the whip on everybody else. But you wouldn't have to crack the whip on this old dude here or this old lady here because she is out trying to outdo everybody because she want to do good in front of master. She want to make master proud. You know what I'm saying? Have mercy. She won't boss to look at her and be like, y'all need to pick them damn peas like Charlene done. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got nobody out here that's willing to outwork Hop and Bob. I don't know why the hell y'all won't get it together. Whoosh, whoosh. Hop and Bob like, yeah, yeah. These niggas don't know what they do. These niggas don't know what they do. In him, in him, he working. Y'all working. He working. See, boss like me. They like me. They cater to me. They care for me. They don't give a shit about you. But in their mind, as long as they white and out white the workers, shit, I'm somebody. I got a little, I got a little edge on over the rest of you uh, cheese eating that niggas out here. They don't look at me like they look at you because you don't like the white. You don't want to white. You come out there wasting the white folk time. Shit, they need more people like me out there to go down there and get down there and get break your back and sweat. I do white. So work <laughs> is where what derived from 
But somebody took it to a whole nother level. To a whole nother level. That's what you have to have when we're talking about your own personal goals and attaining your own personal achievements. You can't just go out there and do the work. You got to work past that and get to the white. Have mercy. You got to go above and beyond because this is what you want. These are the things that you desire. You can't accept no. Anything less than the best won't do. So this is where you have to apply the wag. Shit. I ain't lying. I'm telling you. If you don't have, I'm telling you, be, you'll find yourself parallel with a lot of people when you simply are putting in the menial minimum amount of effort to do something or to attain a certain thing or in the workplace or in your relationship, whatever. You have a whole bunch of people you can get together with and talk around tables and y'all it'll, it'll be like y'all all the same couple you know what y'all do on Tuesdays we watch say it together y'all Melrose Place I know yeah you do yeah kill yourself drink bleach y'all all oh, y'all ooh where's life taking you no further than the down the road or up the block you know when you strive to go past and beyond you start marking stuff off your bucket list you start marking off places that you never thought you could go Places you could never thought you would ever get the chance to go and, 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 and enjoy. But when you put in the white, oh, yeah, I don't have a whole lot of time to sit around pussyfooting, playing cards, you know what I'm saying, jacking off whatever it is that you do. Because I got some goals that I plan to attain and it just don't require me to stop doing what I'm doing to entertain the masses or, you know, gather in a group or perform at law. You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to be at the party. I ain't going to be at the party. I ain't gonna be at the party. Oh, you still got time? You can go. I don't wanna go. Cause you wanna go somewhere local where everybody gonna be. I wanna shoot past that to where nah, not everybody can go where I'm trying to go. And if you do wanna do that, but then damn it, all I'm telling you is that you have to put in the work. That's all I'm saying. You gotta put in the work. W O O I K. Look it up. You won't find it. I'm telling you, so you might wanna document this. I don't know. But the work is where the reward at. That's another word you ain't heard to. It's the reward, not the reward. The white get you the reward. You see? Have mercy. It's a whole other language. It get deep now. It get deep. But these are the only things that apply to you if you're trying to do next level type boss type shit. And if you ain't, this don't even really apply to you. I hope you got a laugh out of the word usage because it might not make sense to you. It might not sound right. But have mercy. <laughs> these are vaulted ceilings. And I'm going beyond those with the work that I put in. Because the work is the only thing that will get me where it is that I'm trying to go and the things I'm trying to attain. So join me and do your work and claim the rewards that you deserve. To the victor goes the spoils. Have mercy.